Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for coming and watching. So I have a very fun video for you today on two palettes I was sent from Makeup Revolution. I am so, they did send these to me, but I'm, I'm still going to do my honest opinions, everything like that. I just... I'm so excited to try these. Every time they come out with a new palette, I'm like obsessed. I'm like, I have to get that. I want that. Why don't I have that in my life? As you can see from the titles down below, I'm talking about Makeup Revolutions. I heart makeup new palettes called I Heart Obsession. So I did get sent two to try and swatch for you. I did get sent the West End Girls which has got some color to it here. So it does have like, it doesn't have a mirror or anything. So if you're wondering about that, it doesn't have a mirror with this. And it did come with like one of those little dual ended brush thingy, um, sponge brush things. I already took it out, so it didn't fall out. And it comes with like some really awesome colors, like this really bright, vibrant gold color, um, a nice brown, a purpley color, a blue, a gray, a green, and then like some really nice, um, kind of colors you can work with for like highlighting and like inner corners and stuff like that. So like brow bone colors and stuff like awesome kind of colors. So you can do a f quite a few looks with these. So there is 10 shades in these palettes and um, they're matte and shimmery. So there's both. So uh, the next one is, here's the, the brush just looks like this. And here it is. This one is the one I wanted probably the most out of all the palettes, and it's the Pure Cult one. This palette is absolutely stunning, but I will be swatching this palette, Pure Cult. It just looks stunning. It's got, you know, it's pinks, it's like a coppery color, it's got like this really nice dark purpley glittery color here. So these palettes go for... There's five palettes in the collection, sorry, and they go for $3.99, which is pretty much like the um, Redemption palettes, the Iconic palettes and stuff like that. They're four pounds. These are $3.99. You get 10 shades. Um, there's shimmer and matte in them. So the Pure Cult one has one, two, three, four mattes, and then six shimmers. Good math, Ashley. Good math, you know. So that is that. This just looks stunning. I really hope that the camera is picking this palette up. It's just gorgeous. And then um, the, uh, I want to get the name right, West End Girls. This palette has, let's see, it's a bit shimmery. This palette has one true full matte with no glitter at all but this brown is getting towards the glittery color so there is definitely more shimmery um colors in this <coughs> yeah more shimmery colors in this one there's only the one really matte color but they're just it's beautiful okay i really need to swatch these for you guys but anyway i just want to do a little talking about them so these are brand new palettes they're the first limited edition palette, so I'm not sure how long they're going to keep them going for. There are, like I said, there are five palettes in this range. There's their Nudes and Smoky Glamour collection of the Pure Cult and the Born to Die, the Glamour of the West End Girls palette, the Romance of the Paris palette, and the Heartbreaking Shades of Wild is the Wind. So they just kind of sent me this little forms so that I could read that for you. So the, the palettes are called Pure Cult and Born to Die, which are like new to smoky kind of palettes. And then the they classified their West End Girls as a glamour palette, which I completely agree with. The Romance uh, palette is the Paris palette. It's called Paris. And the Heartbreaking palette is the Wild as the Wind palette. So I like that they kind of have that as well, like, you know, the Romance palette and stuff like that. I think that's really cool. So I've been loving Makeup Revolution's eyeshadows. They just seem to really step up their eyeshadows, so I cannot wait to do this. And I'm going to also create a quick look with one of these palettes, which will probably be, you know, probably the Pure Cult one, but I'm not quite sure yet at the same time. So I'm gonna quickly swatch the West End Girls palette for you, and I will be back to show you the swatches. 
Okay, so I have them swatched here and I'm going to show you my arm. Okay, so here's the colors here. I hope you can see them. So you have the gold there and then it goes the brown. So these are the top colors here. Gold, brown, like a burgundy, purpley kind of color. A blue. It's kind of a blue. It's like a black kind of blue. And then you have the gray, which is right there. And then you have this green color. These two weren't as pigmented um, as the other colors were, but they're all right. And then these very, very, I don't even know if you can really see them, colors here are the, the kind of more calmer colors. So you have the white kind of color there. Then you have like this pinky color, which is really not showing up very good. And then this like light browny, coppery color, and then a yellowy kind of white there, which is kind of shimmery. Those are the colors from the, that is the West End Girls palette. So I did, you know, kind of these ones all together and then I left a little space and did the light ones. They were kind of hard to show up on my very white hand or arm hand. They were really kind of hard to show up on there. Okay, so I'm going to quickly swatch the Pure Cult palette now for you, which reminds me of Urban Decay's Naked 3 palette, which looks like this. I've swatched the Pure Cult palette now for you, and they just look like this. So the first color is right here. It's kind of hard to see on my really pale skin. This is like white with a bit of pink in it, and then you have all the other colors there. So they're quite pigmented. They're quite nice. To be completely honest with you, they are really quite nice. They're very um, hard to see on my, most of them are kind of these top ones, are a little harder to see on my arm because I am quite pale, but I'm sure they're gonna look beautiful on. That is Pure Cult, uh, beautiful pinky kind of undertone. So if you really like your pink undertones, this is really nice for $3.99. It's a great um, price. Um, one thing I will say is it does say obsession. I don't know if it'll pick it up on there. It does say on these top ones, it says obsession and then the bottom ones say I heart. Um, though that I heart is going to stay a lot longer. The obsession words are already, you can't even really see it anymore on the white on there. Um, they are fading. So the, if you're like liking that, it's not going to last long because it's already, it's not really deep down. So I don't even care about that, but just so you guys know. This is a beautiful palette for $3.99. You really can't go wrong. These aren't super, super pigmented like um, the Iconic Pro One palette that I have, I think has gotten my hopes kind of really up, um, but these are still really good, still really creamy. Um, they're just like the, I would say they're just like the palettes, the, the kind of style of the palettes like this. I would say they're basically kind of like the same. Um, quite pigmented, quite happy with it. I'm really liking these. This is my kind of first impressions with it. So these palettes are absolutely great and for affordability they're really really nice. I like how big, like how much product you actually get. Like look at how big these are. They're like so big. Like the amount of product you're getting is really, really great. Uh, I would have liked a little bit of a mirror maybe up here just because if you're traveling with this, it might have been nice, but I really like this. For $3.99, these are great. I would just say that um, I don't mind the packaging. I think the packaging is fine for $3.99. It does feel quite sturdy. It does kind of remind me of these. Um, so I do like that. The pigmentation on these is just like, you know, their four pound palettes and things like that. Really quite good. Not as good as the Iconic Pro ones, I have to say that. If you were thinking that this was going to be like that for pigmentation, it's really not. They're not bad pigmentation, do not get me wrong. Like, Makeup Revolution eyeshadows are just absolutely amazing. They're, I just really, really like their pigmentation and everything like that with these palettes. Now, if you would like to see some looks with these palettes, um, leave comments down below saying which palette you would like to see a look with, if it's the Pure Cult one or the West End Girls one. Just leave a comment down below. Um, I will try to do that for you lovely ladies. So, 
Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Please remember to thumbs up this video and also subscribe to see more. And I hope I said everything that I wanted to say about these palettes. Petals are smooth and they're affordable and they're quite pigmented. So if you're on a budget for £3.99 for these lovely, gorgeous colors, like look at some of these colors. They're just absolutely stunning.